Hey mate, yeah, so sorry for late reply on this. Um, this screen box does look good to me. <coughs> uh, if you look here, this red candle here, when, when I see candles like this on a reversal, on a failure, uh, I often like uh, to accumulate below it. So to watch for bullish stop ones down below it. Now there can be early bounces and in the odd occasion, well sometimes you don't get that dip down here and it just continues and moves up. The safe place to be buying is down here though. So the other thing I want to show you is when when you get these moving averages like this, this can become a choppy period before the breakout. So it's unusual, not unusual, well yeah, it's, it's, it's more common to put in a choppy period here or a base. But as you mentioned, the buy point can be down below here. That's the safe place to be buying, down, down below here. And then it gives the moving averages time to build themselves out. Because price essentially needs to get above all moving averages before it can be bullish. So you can see here, you know, it's it's not that easy to just get above all moving averages here. So it might be choppy and eventually it should give you that buy point down below. There, you know, there always is a chance that it does just continue higher from here, right? That's a, that, that is a possibility. Um, it does happen, you know, maybe three times out of 10 or something like that, three or four times out of 10. I don't know the stats exactly, just from watching it. There is liquidity down in the wick here as well. So the ideal thing would be to fill this down here before recovering. If you if you wanted, you could buy like, you know, a quarter of a position here if you really wanted to be in it, just in case, and then add as it goes lower. Otherwise, just wait and see if we get the dip. But uh, then you have no exposure. So it, it's entirely up yourself. There's not a huge stop loss if you wanted to use a stop loss on that. Like if you're buying right now, it's a 2.5% stop loss. But again, the ideal place is to buy lower. So my voice is not great today, mate. I'm just going to cut this off. Oh, sorry. The last thing I wanted to say is, yeah, this 9-week candle is not great. And there's only 5 days left. So it may be better to wait for that 9-week candle to close and trade the new 9-week candle as well. And hopefully that nine, new 9-week candle will actually give you the dip down below here.